In my study, we have identified that many environmental factors over time can turn on or turn off your iron-related genes inside the cells, pushing them towards becoming a cancer cells. Using this knowledge, we have now identified many epigenetic marks that can be targeted to uh, make the cancer cells more susceptible towards the usual chemotherapy drugs. By improving, by doing this, we can improve the chemotherapy effect with less side effects and better outcome in the cancer patients. So what is epigenetics? Epigenetics is a study in which the environmental factors can turn on and turn off the genes in your normal cells and can change the function of those genes with the outcome of, can of a normal cells becoming a cancer cell. To understand epigenetics, we can take an example of identical twins. Both of them have the same genetic makeup. However, one of them could develop uh, a cancer or any other disease over time in their life. However, the other one could live a healthy life. So this is the nature versus nat uh, nurture where the environmental factors can turn on or turn off uh, the genes like a switch and then making the normal cells towards an abnormal cells like a cancer. At the moment in my study we are working with animal models of liver cancers and colorectal cancers. We use uh, all the ethical uh, norms and we take very good care of the animals but we use them in order to do the research of uh, targeting those epigenetic marks by using uh, the environmental factors which could turn on or turn off the genes uh, and then we identify the outcomes of those epigenetic marks in the animal model. By using uh, this model we can get uh, a lot of information in order to how to uh, improve the chemotherapy treatment in the cancer patients. Here at the University of Sharjah my team and I are working with many different models of cancer uh, and we are expecting that within a few years uh, we would be able to identify uh, a specific and novel epigenetic mark uh, in order to use it uh, to target uh, and make the cancer cells more sensitive towards the chemotherapy treatment. At the same time, these epigenetic marks uh, happens very early in the cancer formation. So we are hoping to identify a novel epigenetic mark that could be used to identify cancer patients who are at a very high risk of developing advanced disease. So we can identify them well before they reach the advanced disease stage and start the treatment very early uh, in order to improve uh, uh, the outcome of the cancer patient. In this field of cancer research, what we do is we work towards finding ways to improve patients' life and to, to save the life of cancer patients. And this is what makes me passionate about my research here at the University of Sharjah.